Myra of the Pleiades. Uprooting. Greetings, I am Myra from the Pleiadian High Council. I am here to speak with you today to give you an update about what is occurring on the Earth. I speak as a member of the Earth Council. I work full time with this council and have been for many years. I recommend that you look around and view these occurrences from a different viewpoint than perhaps your current perspective. Maybe you can see the world of the old third dimension crumbling? You might see the strangeness of the old world as you advance into higher consciousness in the fifth dimension or higher. Yes, the energies are strange and can be a bit uprooting. Some of you are observing humanity's behavior as bizarre and maybe even stupid. You might wonder what has been short-circuited in some people's brains when they make the decisions they make. These behaviors can actually push you to your limits. These unreasonable irrational behaviors are showing you the end of the third dimensional earth. You see some people taking risks you would never take. Many have lost their bearings. The old fill-in factors that kept everyone under control are ceasing to exist. The reason for this is that in the higher consciousness none of these old factors are necessary. You will be living in divine flow without the need for the use of lower technology and certainly without lower consciousness. Your blinders are off now and you are seeing it with real-time vision. This means you are awake. Congratulations! The more nonsensical the world becomes, the further you will have risen into the fifth dimension. The time of the old world leaders, organizations, systems, and controls, etc. are departing, thereby giving you the freedom you have long needed and deserved. As your galactic family, we celebrate with you the new beginnings. We cheer you on in every way and we assist where we are needed. You are not alone. We love you, applaud you and are here for you. I am Myra. A message from Lumina, the light takes precedence. Dear ones, you are beginning to lean into the brilliant light that is coming to the earth right now. This light has been official results that will make your heart sing. The days of stress and loneliness are coming to an end. You are coming into the oneness of being with your beloved. This will require some adjustment and adaption but it will be fully worth it. These relationships are not the Hollywood-style romance type of relationship that has been portrayed through the mainstream. They flow and are original and you will remember. You will do your dance together and live in harmony and bliss. These are happening as a result of the Creator's love for you. It is unceasing and never-ending. It is brilliant and divine. You may want to pause and reflect upon these words that I am saying. You might want to breathe them in and let them sink into your heart and consciousness. Having your beloved is part of the self-realization aspect of ascension. It is a gift from Source for all of the hard work that you have done, for the sacrifices you have made, and for your good work for being kind and loving beings of light. The light takes precedence now and is everywhere present full of spectacular colors and hues you have not seen before. You might be able to feel into these energies and be a part of the glory of our Creator in the true splendor of yourself. You are becoming you true God Self. What an assignment you have been in on living on the earth through these turbulent, harsh and challenging times. The rewards will be great, your creativity will soar and you will live the happily in the new world. We thank you so much for all that you have done. You are loved into eternity and beyond.